Ek is Fransijn Laubsche, van die penniemeester van Afroforum Bononi Tak. Ek is betrokken op een persoonlijke vlak met baie van die ou mense, ons, ons kinderhuise, omdat daar groot nood is. En ek voel dat dit is waar ons leemte kan vol. Ons is baie actief in Benoni wat dit aan betref. Ons help by Shady Pines, wat die Alzheimer's huis is. Uh, Kaya Deluxe, wat die uh, wat kinderhuis is. Sia Temba, uh, Oliver House, en so kan ek maar die name opnoem. Op kerstfeest voel ons dat uh, die kinders van alle in die kinderhuis uh, en die ou mensies ook mag graag kerstfeest vier en, en ons spandeer tyd saam met hulle. Ons maak een wishlist waar ons vir hulle geskenke dan volgens hulle eie wishlist by mekaar kry. Ons kry ook al ons rolspelers by mekaar en maak dit een speciale dag vir alkie een wat betrokken is die dag van die kinderkies tot en met die ou mense. My name is Sheena Williamson. Um, I'm part owner of establishment Shady Pines where we take care of Alzheimer and mentally challenged patients. I run the business we have done for 22 years. I run it with my son Sean. We have eight Alzheimer patients and disabled patients. Also on the other side, we have some units. I like to keep the patients as self-sufficient as possible. They're mentally challenged, so they're not able to look after themselves, but still want to have that degree of freedom. I'd like to take this special opportunity to thank Archie, in particular for your organisation, AgriForum, in the Benoni area. Your donations and contributions to us are much appreciated. My name is Anna Pintelaru. Um, so we've opened up our home as a foster home and a place of safety for, for children, for vulnerable children. Um, I've been doing this full time for about seven, eight years now. Children are brought in uh, from social uh, welfare, social workers. It varies from neglect to abuse to child trafficking, it, it varies. At, at the moment we've got 12 children and the maximum we've had is, is 18. Afri Forum is one of our, I think, <laughs> it's definitely our biggest supporter at the moment. They are amazing with um, groceries, non-perishables, clothes, toys, um, and then they also come in and do bigger projects. We've had most recently the whole goat's barn and chicken barn rebuilt. We had two trampolines repaired. We had, they gave us a new trampoline. They came in and uh, fixed our jungle gyms and painted it. They've also put up um, so a little bit, a little obstacle course for the kids. They come in on a regular basis to do clean up. You know, obviously one of our biggest challenges is financial. So uh, I don't, we don't have staff. It's just us. So. Yeah, Yes, they've been great. They, you know, they, they come in and they spend a the day just cutting felt and cleaning up and cleaning pruning trees. 